Hello, my name is Dr. Nish Sonwalkar and I'll talk to you about adaptive mobile learning. As you know, in the last few years, uh, there have been upsurge of smartphones. And this phenomena has been so big that it just uh, exploded uh, with the iPhone uh, changing the game primarily by creating a user interface, which was phenomenal. So with the uh, development of now several uh, clones, I, f I should say, I, uh, of iPhone uh, with Android system as well as uh, other systems like Windows phone and some of the Java-based phones, uh, what we see is that there is upsurge of not only uh, smartphones, but there is also upsurge of apps which are being used by both uh, the Apple App Store as well as uh, Android app market and there are millions of those coming up and they are being used every day on cell phones, uh, smartphones as well as on iPads and also Android tablets. So what we want to look at here is that adaptive mobile learning is the paradigm shift from how we used to learn on desktop and laptop where now we are able to learn on the smartphones as well as iPad kind of tablet systems by connecting a learning system which will uh, aggregate some of these apps in a way that they will allow you to learn through various uh, educational modalities. So the adaptive learning system that we developed for the laptop or what we have discussed in terms of personalized learning systems on desktop now are being put on uh, the uh, the mobile tablets and iPads uh, devices but this translation is not one-on-one -on -one because now we have an opportunity to create a model where all these wonderful educational apps can do certain tasks and those educational tasks then we can be created by an aggregated system where each app has certain functionality almost like if you have a syllabus discussion board chat room all of those become separate apps which are connected through one uh, educational pipeline and educational content is then delivered in the context of adaptive learning uh, objects and these could be smaller objects rather than long-winded online courses so now with these smart apps those are uh, geared towards education. Now we can create on one end the educational learning objects being presented with all the lesson structure that is inherent to a course. But in terms of highly interactive apps which are presenting, let's say, app for lesson one, app for lesson two, app for lesson three. And then at the end of each app, there's also an assessment app which is connected to it. And finally, we also have all the apps to do assessment, grading, reporting and all of that put together. So adaptive mobile learning now is presenting a unprecedented opportunity where all the creativity which uh, is put into these apps can be aggregated together in a very flexible and adaptive way and also personalized way so that you can define your own pathway through this learning trajectories of apps.